The walls of this gallery are a showcase of emotions and creativity from the students at the William Roper Hall School. Our exhibition is Letting the Light In and it's from a Leonard Cohn song and it so portrays our students because we try to deal with positive, positive aspects in their lives and letting the light into their lives, sunshine and light coming through as opposed to darkness. Our kids who have come back, from, you know, come from a background of uh, significant abuse, neglect, um, disadvantage, really have a tough time expressing themselves. That's one of their issues. So actually this approach really highlights that, brings it out. It's a sort of a cathartic experience for them and uh, they love doing this. Our students have so much self-satisfaction from having the opportunity to be creative and to come to the gallery and see their work professionally displayed for the community, for themselves, gives them a lot of self, positive self-esteem. In addition to being a healing method for the kids, the artwork and exhibition are a way to keep the issue of children's mental health in the forefront. You know, one in five yeah. children have a mental health issue. In many ways, uh, children's mental health issues have been sort of in the shadows, as they say. People really aren't aware of it. There's a lot of stigma attached to it. People need to understand this is a very significant issue. These kids have really suffered. We need the community actually to support the work that we do. It's critical. We need everybody to say, this is a very significant issue that impacts the whole community, and we need to do something about it. So if we could highlight this issue about children's mental health, it's great. The student art exhibit runs until May 30th at the Art Point Galleries and Studios. For Go Calgary, I'm Karen Coppins.